Sri Lanka decides it will kick off its special coverage for the 2024 presidential election at 6 a.m. tomorrow. We'll be broadcasting live from the News First studios in Colombo and the election headquarters at Stein Studios in Ratnalana, providing you with updates from across the country using the latest technology. Our dedicated team includes over 200 regional correspondents and the News First reporters, all prepared to deliver in-depth coverage. Before voting begins, we'll connect with election officials and the police to ensure you receive timely and accurate information. And once the polling booths open, we'll keep you updated on important developments, including election announcements, ballot box transport and vote counting. By tomorrow evening, we'll share everything from the first official postal vote results to the final tallies of the 2024 presidential election. And now let's cross over to News First's Therani Karnaratna for an update on the preparations. Tomorrow, Sri Lanka decides who its new leader will be for the next five years. Starting from 7.30 a.m. tomorrow until 4.30 p.m., the people of Sri Lanka will be exercising their voting powers to elect the ninth executive president of the Democratic Socialist Republic of Sri Lanka. Now, as the final preparations to hold the 2024 presidential election are underway, we at News First are also on our final stages of preparing to bring you the official election results and other related updates first and fast as usual. Let's head on in. We are at the Stein Studio Complex in Rathmalana, where we are all set to bring to you uh, the official results of the 2024 presidential election and all election-related updates first and fast with the aid of the latest AI technology with the support of multiple foreign companies as well. As you can see, we're at the Stein Studio Complex. The team is very busy. You can see that they are in their final stages of preparation for the 2024 presidential election. Well, as I said before, vote counting ends at 4.30 p.m. tomorrow and we'll be having correspondents stationed at all election counting centers island-wide and with the assistance of such a widespread network, News First will be at the forefront of bringing to you the very latest, most accurate information first and fast, just like we always have. Now, this is also a friendly reminder that in addition to the official election results, we are all set to bring to you trilingual panel discussions with experienced journalists in the panel, uh, where we will be analyzing statistics and data from, from past presidential elections here in Sri Lanka which will give you a better understanding about the past elections that have occurred in Sri Lanka, about the results, how the candidates have fared. We do understand uh, that you will be very excited to see how your preferred candidate or candidates have fared this year. News First has got you covered as we, through all these methods, will be bringing you the most accurate information first and fast with the aid of the latest AI technology like you've never seen before. So stay tuned with News First throughout the day. Tomorrow we will be bringing to you the latest updates right to your living room or right to your fingertips. Signing off for now from the Stein Studio Complex in Rathmalana, I'm Thiruni Karna Ratna.